it's my birthday yeah we made it <laughs> so first off i will address the obvious i have been very sick these past few days so that's why my voice sounds like ridiculous and today i woke up and it's actually way better than it has been and it's like 5 30 a.m right now because i don't have to go to school till like we leave here around seven i had to get up really early because i didn't finish doing my homework last night so i've gained this habit this year where i don't finish my homework the night before and I just get up really early the next morning and do it all in the morning. It's really stressful because if you don't finish in time, then you go to school and you haven't finished your homework. I'm just going to get ready now. And I kind of wanted to give myself time to like get ready and like eat breakfast with my family since it's my birthday. And I'm going to straighten my hair. And I know my hair looks really ridiculous. It's like so wavy right now. But I think that's partially because, I don't know if you can tell, but I got my roots done last night just because they're getting pretty bad. And I feel like when I get my hair done, it kind of dries it out, you know, since it's like getting highlights. So it, that's why it's like extra curlier than normal. Um, but my hair isn't naturally straight. It's kind of naturally a little bit wavy. So I'm going to be straightening it. And I've tried a bunch of different straighteners, but I probably am going to say that the Chi Air is like always my favorite. Okay, so yesterday when I went to my hairdresser's, she started putting in like this leave-in conditioner. She was spraying it in my hair and it smelled so good. It smelled like yummy, sweet coconut. And I was like, what is it? I have to have it. So naturally, I went to Sephora last night and bought it. It's like Bumble and Bumble, hairdresser's invisible oil, heat protective primer, blah, blah, blah. And I love it. It seriously smells so good. Like, I literally would recommend it even though I've used it like once, but I sprayed it in my hair last night and it feels pretty good. It's like a leave-in conditioner and it protects against heat, so can't get much better than that. And I guess I'll stop blabbing now because I know I'm going to have like a lot of footage today. I'm super excited and yeah, but there's going to be some surprises later. Hint, hint, wink, wink, but I'm going to straighten my hair now. Okay. Happy birthday! Mm -hmm. Happy birthday. <laughs> Lucy, I've been up for the past, like, hour getting ready. Stop teasing me about my makeup. Or... Girl, stop. It's okay. <laughs> <coughs> All right. So I finished doing my makeup. And I straightened my hair. Oh, yeah. And it's actually feeling so, so dry since I got it highlighted. So I use this oil that I've been using a lot. It's the Numi Argan Oil. And it literally smells so good. And it makes my hair feel not so dry and guys I wanted to show you something really sad so my studio fix powder from MAC let's just look at this really quick all right hopefully I get a new one for my birthday I'm in NC 30 and it dropped on the ground and got cracked and look there's just little pebbles left so I've been just like swirling my brush around in the mid to try to get it to like use it all but yeah, that's about that. So I'm going to go put on some clothes and eat breakfast. Sneak peek. Oh yeah, it worked. Happy He has red hair. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Happy birthday. Clovis! <laughs> Wait, show you know, how you, can, show in, you can move the skin on your head. It's really cool. <laughs> <laughs> Shout I sound Peter like Crummy. a smoker laughing, but that's actually so funny. So no, GLB. <laughs> no. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> birthday surprise! <laughs> Stop. What will um, what will my subscribers think about this? I hope people don't leave any comments. There's gonna be some like big long comments about how much. No, either people model. are gonna like it or people are gonna. Hate it. Okay, guys, really, <clears throat> let's just put in a little disclaimer. Sorry, <coughs> I sound like a smoker. Yeah, I'm sick too. Okay, they and me are sick at the same time. Look at Tender. that. <laughs> Tender. <laughs> okay, so even though we're both terribly sick, we're like sniffling we're messes. Kidding. Even though we're both really sick, um, okay, so. Basically, bottom line is, we just got our belly buttons pierced. And 
I'm really excited because I'm not kidding. I literally want my belly button pierced since I was probably eight or nine years old. Like ever since I saw yeah. it, I wanted it. And you want to stop at CVS now? Because Haley. Should I? Yeah. Probably. <coughs> when Bay calls <gasps> in sync with you, greater than. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> okay. So we've wanted our belly button pierced forever, and my parents weren't kind of really keen on the idea. And Today is my 18th birthday, so I could like legally do it by myself. But I did tell my parents, and they're kind of like so-so about it. But I they do know, they do know that it's happening. Hannah did not tell her parents, but they'll be Surprise! okay. Surprise! Surprise, mom and dad! I'm not telling them yet. So I hope none of you leave like any mean comments or anything, because this is just something that I want to for a while, like for myself, because I personally just think they're pretty. I'm not doing it because I want other people to think anything of it. I just want it for myself, and. I know one of my friends was telling me that this might be a bad thing to do as like a role model for like young girls, but I want you to know that if you're like younger and you're watching my videos, like this doesn't mean like go get your belly button pierced. Like by all means, do not get your belly button pierced. And if you think they're pretty too, um, either ask your parents and strongly think about it or like wait till you're 18. But like definitely too, I put in so much thought into it and like research, like we had to figure out where we wanted to go, like we figured out like how long it would take to heal, like everything you have to do for it, so we were really like careful about it and everything, but yeah, this is just something that we decided we wanted to do, and I'm really excited that I did, so 18th birthday surprise, this is what I was referring to earlier, earlier when I was vlogging, I was like, surprise to come later, but yeah, so woohoo, we did it, can I put in that picture of you getting it done? No. Here's a picture of Hannah getting it done no. right here! But yeah, but anyways, now we're at CVS because I got to get some solution to clean my belly button because I'm very responsible. <laughs> and it didn't even hurt that bad. We decided because they like clamp um, your belly button. So when they actually put the needle through, it doesn't even hurt that bad. Like we were just saying that the part that hurts the most is when they're actually like sliding in the ring after the needle goes because I looked down and like the needle was there, but then I, they have to like put the ring in, so that's the part that hurts the most. But then once it's in, like I literally don't even feel it right now. Like we don't feel it. It's like not bad. I didn't know guys don't know too much about them. Like I didn't even know. I thought if you had a belly button piercing, like you could never take it out. Like I thought it always had to be in there. So that's why I was scared to get it. But then like no, like it's like an ear piercing. Like you can just take it out whenever. So that's why I'm not worried. Like. If I, like, if I don't want it in there, I can take it out. So it's, like, not a big deal. Um, oh, it just hurt when I twisted. I was reaching back and I twisted. Yeah. That hurt. I like, move this right my own <laughs> here. But, yeah, there it is. So, yeah, did super happy. <laughs> now we're off to crew on our birthday. I haven't gone to crew for these past two days because I felt awful. But... I'm still feeling obviously kind of sickish, but I'm just gonna try to go. Maybe I'll like bike and do core and stuff. I'll try to do as best I can. But yeah. Poor little Lulu's been having headaches. How'd you feel? Good. That's what I like to hear. I said not good. Oh, I thought you said good. <laughs> it's okay. Everything's gonna be okay. All right, up to crew. Do, do, do. <laughs> I went like this. <laughs> I just finished getting ready for my birthday dinner. Ooh. And it's this top from Urban Outfitters. It has these like lacy sleeves and it's like a sheer like blouse right there. And I'm wearing my necklace from J. Crew. I just thought I'd show you because like why not? And then I'm wearing my black Lululemon leggings because they're literally the only pants I wear. Like Okay. Lucy wants to be filmed. Let's go. Party. <laughs> she goes, I put on pants. Because <laughs> usually she doesn't wear pants. So she gets mad when I film. Because she's like, I'm not wearing pants. Man. No, I am. Looking I like parted my hair in the middle so it would be like easier to separate it. Um, but now my hair's parted in the middle. It's so pretty. <gasps> Did you see it? Did you take that? Did it burn you? <laughs> I grabbed the metal part. Like, yeah. <coughs> Lou! At least you have a glove. No, no, with this hand. Oh. Like, like, well. It was like my thumb. 
Okay, we have to go get Danny. Come on. I have like one piece. Chop, chop. Oh, okay, guys, story time. So, I just went to school a little bit because, you know, that's what kids do these days. And then I went to get my belly button pierced. It's going good. Then I went to practice. It really wasn't a good idea. I like went on the bike for like the shortest amount of time. I think I only went like 25, 30 minutes and I was like dying. Like I just, it made me feel way worse. So I don't know if practicing right now is such a good idea in my state of being, but story time. So everyone like in my town in school and area is like sick right now. If you guys are sick too, like you yeah, feel me, everyone's just getting sick. And so I think I got my mom sick because my mom started to get really sick last night and this morning we were having our birthday breakfast and she was sitting there like shivering like poor thing like I know what you're going through so basically my mom's sick and we are also supposed to go to birthday dinner tonight with like Justin and Danny too bring the boyfriends along but since my mom's really sick my dad has to like stay home and take care of her so Lucy and me and Justin and Danny are just gonna go out to dinner instead so it's just gonna be the four youngins night out on the town so we won't be with our parents so that's just the deal with that that's like why that will be us four later and not our parents too can we try to get them in some vlog lulu let's do it let's secretly do it they'll go like this because they probably don't want to be in it but too bad they're gonna anyway it looks good like no but then it won't like like cause, so now my hair is actually middle parted it's okay if it's middle parted it looks pretty like that no worries but Sincere dedication is going on right now because I'm going to film the voiceover for my prom video that is already up if you are watching this. So that means my prom dress is still on eBay and you should probably go check it out and buy it because then it'll be so cool that you could wear the dress that I wore last year because it's literally the prettiest dress ever and if it was me I wish I could wear it again because I literally love it um, but I can't and I knew it would just sit in my closet and I knew one of you would love to have it. And I paid, like, a lot of money for it, so hopefully one of you can get good use out of it. So, yeah, go bid on that. It's linked down below. So, basically, I was saying I need to film a voiceover for that video, and it's been ready to go up for, like, two days, but I've just been putting it off because I sound like this, but it's just going to go up anyway, and I'm probably going to have to apologize at the beginning, like, sorry, I'm really sick, that's why I sound like this, but it's got to be done, i got to do it. I will get some fun birthday footage later and yeah I'm gonna film my voiceover now Woo! Woohoo! on our way to get Justin and there's um Danny right there and see it's kind of dark you can't see them but we're on our way to dinner even though it's like past seven o'clock it's kind of late oh it's so dark in here you can't see anything no, no. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Oh, you don't do it well. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> so, we're on our way home from dinner now. My voice gets worse as the night goes on. I'm sorry. They're laughing and saying that I sound like Mickey Mouse because I was talking in a really high voice, so my voice wouldn't hurt and it wouldn't, like, crack. This looks going to be really funny to look back on when my voice is, like, normal again, and I'm like, what were you doing, Gretchen? Anyways, we're on our way home now. I'm actually vlogging with Lucy's phone. There's so many pods. I'm not vlogging with mine because it died. So, Danny, Justin, Lucy, and I went to Bellini's, and if you're wondering, our parents didn't come, but like I said earlier, because my mom's sick and my dad had to take care of her, I got her sick. It's just a rough birthday for us, but 18 nonetheless, I'm very excited. So, went to Bellini's, and I just made this decision on a whim on the way there. You guys have probably noticed, some of you I know definitely have, I've actually had a personal Instagram for as long as I've had my YouTube one. I'll just tell you right now because I revealed it to all of you because I just decided, you know, all of you are finding it anyway, you want to follow it, and I did want to keep it separate for a while, like I just wanted my personal one to be with like me, and, like my friends, like my hometown, and my YouTube one to be with like all my YouTube like subscribers, people. But I decided, you know what, YouTube really is my life, so we're just going to combine them. And, like, if you guys want to follow my personal one, go ahead. Like, you're my friends, too. So, I told you guys, like, go ahead and follow my normal Instagram. So you also can follow this little peanut, Lucy. You also have said, like, where's Lucy's Instagram? And I haven't given that away because it's, like, with our personal one and it has, like, our last name on there. If you want to follow my personal Instagram... It's at Gretchen with five ends at the end. Very creative. Just lots of ends because I don't know why I did that when I did that like forever ago. 
and Lucy's is at Lucy Garrity, which is our last name. Can't believe I'm actually saying our last name in a video because I cats feel like it's like a now. yeah, really uh, cats yeah. out of the bag. That's what I mean. <laughs> Because I feel like it's a very like secret thing on YouTube, like no one will say their last name. So, my last name is Garrity. It's spelled really funny. I'll list it right here. Lucy's at Lucy Garrity with two Y's because there's surprisingly another Lucy Garrity on this she planet. She lives in Australia. Really? That's crazy. Gold. Go follow her. Gretchen with five N's. And Justin's is at Justin Brem 5 if you want to follow him. Because I know a bunch of you want to follow him. And Danny's is just at Danny Bram. I think it's Danny Bram TS. Yeah, Danny's is just Danny Bram. So, I think that covers about everything. This is a day of big reveals because we have my belly button being pierced. We have we have the Instagrams coming out. If you want to follow my Twitter, it's actually a funny name. It's at Gretchen, G-R-E-T-C-H-I-E-N. Go ahead and follow that. That's my normal Twitter. Um, so I guess you can follow GLBYT, which is my YouTube Twitter. That'll really upset the... You're gonna get confused, because you can just follow, like, four of my accounts. Hey, follow my Tumblr, too. It's Gretchen Loves Beauty with two eyes. There's lots of instructions. Go follow all of those. And they all have different names. Yeah. <laughs> How confusing. Okay, we're now home in the garage, because we just got home. Today's been a very good birthday. <laughs> I am very happy. It's been fun. Everyone's been very kind. I love how nice everyone is on your birthday because everyone's so nice to you and positive. And when, like, other people are happy, I honestly just feed off of their, like, positivity and, like, happiness. So everyone all day is like, happy birthday. And I'm like, ah, oh, sweet. Yes. And, uh, go. Hug them. Go life. I'm like, you know, thanks. I just get so happy. So even though I'm obviously kind of down about being, like, terribly ill, um, everyone just being happy today has been good. And the fact I get to share it with my baby she's gonna oh, get me sick i can't believe you're old and i'm not gonna get you sick no worries yeah, no you can't be 18 no, we're 12 i know in our heads we were saying we're still 12 it's 2009 everyone <laughs> we like don't feel like we're 18 Long at all 2009 am i right <laughs> we came home and what was there Lady. everything look it It's so beautiful. There's like streamers and there's know. the aftermath to like all our presents. Look at there's a picture of Lucy and me. <laughs> LOL. It's beautiful. It's beauteous. Daddy. I'll put in a picture right here of what it looked like before we ate our cake and opened all our presents and stuff so you can see how pretty it was when we first walked in. But now everything's like ripped apart because we opened presents and ate our cake and stuff and it was so good. And there's two cakes because Taylor is the best friend ever and she brought us over a bunch of stuff, right Lou? Yeah. She brought like cake Everything. and even more presents even though she already gave us presents yesterday at our like um friend dinner. Hey, that balloon is huge, Dad. Did you get it or did Taylor get it? Taylor. Oh, uh, I love it. Taylor, you're the I feel so bad she had to Wait, let's just look how huge room. this is. Like, let's just take a moment, everyone. I did. I wasn't kidding. It's like 10 times the size of my head. Huh? And, yeah, she surprised us with balloons in our room, too. That's so freaking sweet. And she filled up this thing with, like, candy and cute little tumblers. Like, sweet and mommy and daddy food. got us a bunch of good presents they got us stuff for college oh i love it and yeah cool. we're very like good little mom um little mom so happy birthday kind of star mm -hmm. oh. say bye